David Schmidt. I've lived in the States, so I came straight over to Virginia, this area. I've been here for 16 years, and I mean, as soon as I got here, I fell in love with it. You know, it's a great little town, really friendly people. It's, it's just a, a really a good little place. You know, it's in the country, sure. I mean, I've lived in cities before, but uh, I really like the small little towns and stuff. And I was born in South Africa, and then when I was about three months old, my parents moved up to Zambia, where I grew up to the age of 14. And then, uh, and that's what I told you about going to boarding school down in Grahamstown, South Africa. And then my parents moved from Zambia to Cape Town when I was 14 years old. Lived there for another 14 years, and then, and that was in Cape Town. Then lived in London for a little while, and went went back to Cape Town. Lived there for a while, and then came over here. So, I, I mean, obviously coming over to a new country, the cultures are, are different, so you have to adapt, as you guys know. So but the things that I really miss about Cape Town is obviously your friends that you leave behind there, you know. But you know the friends that are there, they're always going to be there. But and also, I guess the main thing is just the cultural change to come over here, and then also the climate as well. You know, Cape Town has a very moderate climate, similar to California, which that's why I love to go up to California. It's got that Mediterranean climate. And I didn't know a lot about the states till I came over here. I mean, only what you see on TV is limited. You know, you watch movies and stuff, but you really don't know too much. Until you actually live here, then you realize what it's really like, you know. And that's why I really like the small town. People are so friendly and have been so good to me that, you know, it's just been great. <laughs> <laughs> how, how white is snow really? I mean, it's hard to tell you. I mean, it's it's white. I mean, it's just really bright white. But uh, yeah, I mean, just bright white. I mean, that's I, I don't know how else to uh, explain it. But obviously, snow is beautiful when it's a nice quiet day and it's just you know when it's just snowing, just really quiet and it's serene, you know. But it's not that I like it all the time, but I like it a little bit of it for sure. Uh, my name is Farron Smith uh, from Whitfield, Virginia, uh, founder of the Edith Bowling Wilson Birthplace Museum. Uh, the Edith Bowling Wilson Birthplace Museum uh, is special for several reasons. It's in the heart of downtown Whitfield. It is historic because it is a, uh, a birthplace of a first lady. It is the only uh, birthplace museum of a first lady in Virginia and only one of a few uh, across the entire United States. Um, so it's very special to us. Uh, it's educational programs, uh, the economic benefits to our area. Uh, and our main concern is that it be torn down someday, which happens with so many historic sites. And we want to make sure this home uh, is protected and preserved for future generations.